Hello everybody, Smoke and Smokes here. Gonna be doing a tobacco review on Captain Black Gold. Now if you've seen my previous videos, you might be like, hey, that looks different from the usual stuff you get from pipesandscars.com. That's true. Uh, that's because I got this from a different website. I, I don't even remember what the site was. I'll just annotate it, but I just tried it because um, I tried Captain Black Regular, the white kind, and Captain Black Royal, which I just showed you right here. As you can see, there's not much left because I, I love it so much. Um, and I wasn't super interested in this, I just got it because I wanted to complete this circle, but then of course I found out there's a couple different, I think there's three more Captain Blacks in there, there might be even more, I don't know, but out of the three I tried anyway. This was everybody's least favorite, according to the reviews I saw on the multiple websites, saying, eh, this is my least favorite, or eh, don't waste your time, just get white or royal or something, but honestly, I happen to really, really like this. Um, let me give you the specs real fast. It is made of Cavendish in Virginia. It is made in the United States. It is a loose cut. On PipesandCigars.com, they call it a room note of 2 out of 5. That's mellow. And a flavor intensity of 2 out of 5. Mellow. Its strength is also 2 out of 5, mild to medium. Which I would call mellow. <laughs> um, and... That's about it. It says its flavor is miscellaneous. I call it tobacco flavored. Um, it's difficult to describe flavors like this when there is no set flavor, like it tastes like, I don't know, vanilla or chocolate. It's not supposed to taste like anything specific like that, it's just a good aromatic tobacco, that's what it is. I have, but all I can say is I like this more than Captain Black regular in the white pouches. I got this at the grocery store just because they had it. I was like, you know what, I'll get it. It was a little bit more expensive, but eh, whatever, eight dollars for a pouch like this. Who cares, by the way, these one ounce bag, I think this is like a two ounce, no, 1.5 ounce. This is a um, one ounce bag for $2.95 you get five cigars to come. You can get Captain Black everywhere. Um, but I like this more than Captain Black regular. I did a review on the, the regular one and I said it was okay, I thought it was okay, but I actually tried this next to this. I had two pipes and I had both the tobaccos in them just to give it a try. And I like this a lot better than this one. This has kind of a more chemically taste to me. The more I think about it, I'm not saying it's horrible, it's just okay. May like it, may not. I don't love it really. But this I like, I really, really like, almost love it. It's, I love Captain Black Royal, but this is in between, I think, Classic and Royal. If I had to go from least good to best, it would be uh, regular, gold, and then Royal. What does it taste like? Finally, <laughs> two minutes and four seconds of the review. What does it taste like? Um, Very difficult to describe, but it is a mellow flavor. That's how I would describe it. It's, it's kind of a medium to hot kind of heat to it, unfortunately, but most aromatics are like that, so it's not a huge surprise, I don't think. Um, it smokes fairly hot sometimes if you, I think, puff on it too much, but it's very flavorful. It almost has a nutty note to it. That's how I would describe it. It's nutty. It's kind of sweet. It's slightly sweet. It's a little nutty. It's velvety and smooth. Think of like su a sweet nut. Sweet nuts. It's, that's how I would describe the flavor. It's very, very, very difficult to describe tobaccos sometimes, especially to people who never had tobacco or haven't had much. They're like, what are you talking about? What does that mean? So. But um, that's me trying my best to describe it. Like, sweet nuts, I guess. If anybody else has had this before and you have a better description of it, if you think, please feel free to post it in the comments. Um, but yes, it's it's mellow, too. It's not so mild. Like, oh, I don't really taste anything. But it's not, like, full-bodied or anything. It's in between. It's, like, it's just kind of a smooth, mellow, nice, velvety flavor. And the flavor gets kind of more bitterish and less flavorful as you go get closer to the ashes. That's that's just the most aromatics, unfortunately. But I don't I don't define it as very chemically tasting. I just think it, it's nutty, nutty and creamy. I think it's pretty good. Um, I think Captain Black regular is kind of chemically though. Not a huge fan of this, although I will have it every now and then. My favorite still so far is Captain Black Royal because it's more sweet, it's more rich, and tastes like chocolate to me. That's how I would describe it, like a chocolate type thing. But this is like a a smooth, almost vanilla. I don't even know if vanilla is not the right word. Nutty. It's a nutty flavor. I really, really like it. Actually, I will be having it more often. I do like it. Not so much the regular one. I won't have that more often too much. But that. So that's just me giving you a comparison there. Not knocking the regular one. Not saying it's bad. If you like it, be my god. It's, it's one of the most popular tobaccos out there. So people like it. It's out there for a reason. People like it. I'm just saying personally, I like gold more. And I'm just going out on a limb here, and I'm making this video a little bit lengthier than it should be. Um, but that's because a lot of people out there are saying this was their least favorite out of the Captain Blacks. But I completely disagree. It's Out of the three I tried, it's my second favorite, I could say. I like it. I think it's a good, well-made tobacco. And you can get it pretty much everywhere. You go to the grocery store or 
any store out there, basically, they'll probably have it if they have tobacco or pipes. Um, nice color, too. I guess that's why they call it gold, because this is like a nice, delicious golden color there. But yes. The room note on it, what's the the room note is okay. It's not an amazing room note. It just it kind of smells the way it tastes a little bit, you know, nutty, creamy, not super sweet of a room note. But it, it's I think people would think it smells okay. Whatever, it's an aromatic. So that's that. That's my overly long review on Captain Black Gold. I'm just saying I'm a fan and I like it. And if you're interested, I recommend it.